I'm at Bergstrom Audi of Appleton. Not a completely full lot across the street from uh, Nissan, or basically the Bergstrom dealership, Nissan VW. Uh, most of the lots are overfilled with uh, SUVs. There's a few SUVs here, but I guess being a luxury brand, they're not as uh, heavily stocked with vehicles as some other uh, manufacturers might be. Oh, let's see what they got. Okay, here is some new 2024 A6. Now yeah, we're looking at 63,000. Nice one. Look at that tan color. 92,000 in a Q8. These are uh, very similar stands to some of the other makes. Hard to see what uh, sets them apart. Oh, we got an e-tron. Station wagon, basically. Basically $80,000. We still have to buy gas for it, but uh, you need to put those solar panels up. Oh, that's the cheapest Audi. 41,000 for an Audi Q3. Compared to some of the other things I've seen, that seems reasonable. That's the S line. It's a little nicer package. Yeah, that's not bad. You're spending a little bit of money. I mean, if, if you're buying a car, I mean, look at some of the higher end brands, you know, comparatively. You want to get the best for your money. I mean, these depreciate like anything else, but there's not anybody really selling SUVs for much under 50 grand. I mean, maybe your Hyundais and some of your VWs, but if you're looking for a uh, higher end, Although you do have to do the research. I mean, higher end isn't always higher end, or higher end isn't always better. Sometimes a higher end is, uh, you know, just more problems, more expensive to fix. Well, I did not know they made, uh, well, it's a 2025 SQ7, over $100,000. Dusk is free. Very nice. And I guess not that different than some of the Range Rovers out there. Full hatch opens. Yeah, I was just in Q7. It's another example of uh, price difference. Yeah, 69000 Depends on how expensive the options are to you. Same body, very different price. 40,000 different. Ah, uh, there's a lot more cars here. A lot of them have plates on, so must be service and, uh, that must be service. Q5 Audi Quattro. Kind of a mid-size SUV. 2024, definitely sitting on some 2024s. 24 miles to the gallon. Hi, there's not much else to show you here. Service the building. Uh, truck repair next door. Uh, when there's a bunch of service vehicles, you gotta wonder, because over at Audi or at uh, Lexus, there was a lot of service vehicles, but it looked like it was all the loaners. I didn't really see Lexuses in the uh, service department, or not owned. The ones that were there had uh, dealer plates on them. But that is basically what we have for uh, Audi of Appleton. Thank you.